half of women in British prison, prison suffer from anxiety, depression, a quarter of them have psychosis, yeah. uh, and nearly half of uh, women in prison will have thought about or attempted mm. suicide. And sometimes, like you said, the crime, I'm not saying it's a petty crime, because, you know, people are stealing from your shop and you've got a business, it's, you know, it's still a crime, but something like that, I think maybe that's community service and so that you keep their families yeah. together, but they're still punished exactly. in some yeah. way. But in this case that we're talking about, it says here she, quote, drove like a lunatic as she tried to evade police in her friend's BMW. Now, she's the primary carer for a two-year-old, but her... He jailed her for four months, but the judge said about the sentence, I'm reducing it because you are a mother, but that doesn't mean you get a get-out-of-jail-free card. And she was obviously very surprised to be sent to prison, but she was given mm. four months. Um, I mean, it's quite she, she, stole, she, she stole, stole the car. She stole the car. Well, she oh, said yeah, she borrowed case, it from absolutely. a friend, but without his yeah. permission. So yeah. effectively, she <laughs> took his car. <laughs> yeah. Took his car. <laughs> the, the police, she was driving at 90 miles an hour yeah. in a 30 mile an hour. Uh, limit. Yeah. Yeah. The blue, they could have killed someone. Her. They yeah. had the blue lights on. She didn't Disgusting. stop. Yeah, exactly. She, she put the police life in life danger. She put the yeah. public's life in yeah. danger. And she, she, she didn't hurt anyone, otherwise the crime yeah. would have been a lot worse. She absolutely deserved to go to prison, like you say. Just thank God there was nobody round one of those blind bends because she would have killed them. Yeah.